here at the Great Culture Summit Challenge of 2023. Today, facing off against each other, we have got Lifehouse Church from Chesterfield versus Audacious Church from Sheffield and Manchester. It's going to be epic. Yeah, my name's Paul, Team Lifehouse. My name's Daniel, Team Lifehouse. My name's Kev, Team Lifehouse. Hello, I'm Josh. Hey, I'm Rafaro. Our team challenge today is building a raft out of material that's going to get them across this lake and back again with a few challenges thrown in for good measure. Let's go and see how the planning and preparation's getting on. Okay, guys, and fill me in. What is the plan right now? So, so the plan is to do our best to get these foams, uh, which are the barrels uh, for the raft, and get them across the lake as safely as we can. We do not want to get wet. Plan is to win, um, to get across the water as quick as we can without getting wet. I think, I think we've got the advantage. Less weight, less dead weight. <laughs> um, Rafaro can't swim though. Bonus is quite romantic, really, isn't it? What do you think, Rafaro? You could take a day out on this boat. Sure, we could go on a day out on this boat, mate. Well, I'm married, but I know you're single. So, again, if there's anyone out there, Culture Summit, we've got a young single. He's read the Bible at least twice, and uh, he has a nice look at that smile. <laughs> <laughs> the rafts have been made, the teams have been prepped and they are coming up to the water now. Who's gonna win? Is it gonna be Team Lifehouse or is it gonna be Team Audacious? Let's find out. concern going on not all three are on the raft and it is looking like it's falling apart already audacious storming ahead come on, boy, keep it together. come on team lifehouse you can do it Woo! team audacious are going for the points i believe that is rafaro he is going for a stand up he is up on his feet. That is Rafaro up on his feet. That's extra points. He's in. He has fallen in. Team Audacious. Remember, down the raft is everywhere. It's fallen apart. Oh my goodness, is this the moment that Lifehouse take it back? Team Audacious, the raft has fallen apart. Josh is in. He's in. They are in the water. It is turning out to be neck and neck. Will Team Lifehouse go for the bonus points? Will they stand up? Will they switch seats? Lifehouse. Oh, they're going for it. He is standing. That is a crouch. He's going for it. He's going up. He is up. That is 10 extra points to Lifehouse right now. They may only have two parts of their raft left, but they are still going. Ladies and gentlemen, Team Audacious. They have made it back to shore with some parts of their rafts. Not all, but some. Team Lifehouse still giving it every bit that they've got. That is Lifehouse back on the shore. Both teams made it back. There you have it, ladies and gentlemen. The teams are back on shore, but who has won? All I know is Team Audacious definitely made it back first. However, their raft was in pieces. So at this point, we're going to go to our independent adjudicator. Can you tell me a little bit more? Who may have won? What happened to the rafts and your thoughts? Um, so obviously one team got through in one piece, the other team fell apart. Um, so we're going to go to Team Lifehouse because they actually managed to get all the way to the far side and back. Team Lifehouse have it ladies and gentlemen! There is your trophy. Any winning words team? Uh, we're just highly delighted. We've, we've come all this way just for this moment. Um, we're just thrilled and we are actually we are actually really pleased to beat Rafaro and Josh. There you have it. That is the Great Culture Summit Challenge of 2023. Team Lifehouse have won it. Big congratulations, Team Audacious. We still love you. This time, next year, maybe we'll see you there. <laughs>